if we gather today in this Eucharist, it is not only that we pray for our dear beloved George. We gather not simply to grieve the parting of our dear leader, but to thank God for his life who gives us that same vision toward politics of unity and peace. to the mission of Christ's discipleship. Kitang tanan. Kung kita, mga sumusunod ni Kristo, hinahanglan ta tao nga malinawon o muambit o kalinaw. To honor our former governor, George Hofer, as the founding father of Sibugay, is to recognize his love for us, Sibugay nun. Higup ma siya sa ato all the years of his political career and his person. For those of you who would know him, the people of Sibugay is close to his heart. His mission of birthing Sibugay carries also his vision of greater good for his people of which we now benefit in cherries in freedom. goodness in him found the goodness in others, which is what God has been telling us all along in his commandment, to love one another. By Matthew's account then, George T. Hofer seems to have passed the test easily. That realization brings for us immense comfort and consolation. And Dad, with the realization, we remember your dream and your vision. The dream that one day, in our beloved Sibugay, no one will go hungry or be thirsty or be homeless. The dream of self-sufficiency for every Sibugaynon so that they can stand proudly and successfully on their own. Salamat, uh, ako mo hangyoon nga magmalipayon ta kay si Daddy ni Ubana sa Ginoo mintras kita galisod pa ta og pagpakabuhi. Daghang salamat sa tanan nga nitambong nakig sandurot namo aning panahuna og ato ang tagaan siya og maayo nga send off walo kaadlaw nga haya ang among mga kaila, amigo o mga supporters, daghang kayong salamat sa inyong pagtambayayong namo. Mamiss na ako siya because of that smile niya. Kana ang mong ipili sa tarpaulin na ibutang. Kana nga smile. Ang lisod nga uh, malimtan. And of course, ang legacy nga iya hang ipili. Go, ang legacy ni mo, dili mawala kay ang duha pa ni mo kaanak magpadayon magpadayon mo continue sa legacy nga imo ang ibilin We will continue your vision Jeff and I and our whole family solemnly promise that we will carry the torch for you and make your dreams for Sibugay come true. And we will do it guided 
marvelously by your principles and inspired wondrously by your heart. Dad, your slogan goes, Great Things Happen with George T. Hofer. And now today, we, your faithful Sibugainons, realize that the greatest thing that happened to Sibugay was George T. Hofer. nga kaayo kay siya mangyud ang hinungdan nga namugna ang lalawigan sa Sambuanga Sibugay siya mangyud ang naningkamot nga mapatukod ang kapitulyo mo busa ni ami aron mo padayag sa dako namong pasalamat sa kay Dr. George Hofer og sa tibuok pamilya ni ini kami labi na ako akong kuhaon ang panahon karon nga akong mapaabot ang akong pagpasalamat sa kay Dr. George o kay Dr. Dulce o sa Hofer family. Lumads and Christians alike. Paning kahamot. The dialogue to peace. And so to all of us, given that leadership and those who aspire for it, this sad moment must inspire us to make politics at the service of peace and unity. To continue his legacy, whatever culture or religion 
Let us, let us work together. Adapting the words of Pope Francis, he says, to work together for the good of the human family and to practice those virtues that sustain all sound political activity. Justice, equality, mutual respect, sincerity, honesty, fidelity. 